Like, why would you jump out of a perfect, perfect, perfectly good airplane? I don't know why you jump out of a perfectly good airplane. You guys, we've heard that question before, and I don't know where this question comes from, but there's no such thing as a perfectly good skydiving airplane. <laughs> Seriously. Perfectly good airplane number one. This is the first jump plane that I ever rode in. I think it's a Cessna 182. It's out of Skydive Hawaii, Dillingham Airfield. Um, funny story. They were filming that series Lost on the island when uh, I did this skydive. I think it was summer of 2006. Oh, gosh, that was 10 years ago, my first skydive. Celebration. Anyways, um, they were storing the plane wreckage from the show just on the side of the airfield. So this little dinky red plane rolls up. I think I told the guy, that's the smallest damn airplane I've ever seen. He said, all right. All right. As we take off, uh, I see the wreckage on the side of the, the runway, and I'm like, oh my gosh. Um, and here we go. Perfectly good airplane, number two. The de Havilland Twin Otter. I love this thing. It's like everybody's favorite jump plane. I've only flown in a couple, the one at Mile High and a second one at Mile High that is got have Arizona's Otter. Awesome jump planes. Uh, they also use them as float planes and bush planes, like in Alaska to ferry cargo and people back and forth from the bush. Um, not the fastest, but real smooth ride. One of my favorite things to do is kind of sit in the back of the Otter on a summer day and uh, fly with the door open and you just let that breeze come in. Oh, love it, love it, love it. Perfectly good airplane number three, the King Air. Ding! <laughs> This bird is fast up to altitude, but is a tight fit in and out the door. Wingsuiting can prove difficult in this bird because it's fast and you can hit the tail. Want to skydive with more than four people? <laughs> Watch out for that door size. Perfectly good airplane number four, hot air balloon. It's basically just a big bag with hot air in it. And underneath the bag, suspended by these little, it's not even hooks, is it? What suspends the hot air balloon? It's like hung by string. It's string, yeah. So it's a big fabric bag and a wicker basket. And it has like two gigantic flamethrowers at the top of the basket. And that's, and that's how you take off. <laughs> so that's scary and unnerving. And at the top, okay, the top, there's a giant hole that has a parachute vent, which is like if you pull one string and you vent it a little bit, the balloon goes down. If you pull the wrong string, you ventilate the whole thing, and the balloon just, uh, you go down fatally. Fatally. Maybe. Maybe you're magic. Can't count on magic, you guys. <laughs> Perfectly good airplane number five, the Sky Van. <laughs> 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 
Why isn't it a perfectly good airplane? Because it's slow. It takes forever to get up to altitude. This thing looks seriously unaerodynamic. That thing is huge. Do you imagine? It looks so unaerodynamic. It completely does. It looks like it should not fly. But you can do a flip out of it, and that's fun. You can hang on it like you're a monkey. That's fun. It's slow. It's big. It's awkward. But it's a pretty cool airplane. And it smells. You get to run, and you get to jump out the butt. More positives than negatives, really. <laughs> jump out the butt. <laughs> you get to jump out the butt. You get to jump out the butt. Roger, roger. It's like that, wow, it's a cartoon. With Baloo, the cartoon with Baloo, and he flies the airplane, and Kit Cloud Kicker goes out the back. <laughs> tailspin! It's tailspin. like the cartoon Tailspin. Yeah. Perfectly good airplane number five, the Cessna Caravan. I don't, I don't have much to say about this aircraft. It's like the balance between the King Air and the Twin Otter. Both also pretty, pretty perfectly good airplanes. I like it. the caravan because I like the twin ot like the I like the twin otter but you feel pretty crammed in there. I like the caravan because it's a smooth ride, it's quick. And I don't know. The only one I've flown in was Sebastian. <laughs> Frog in my throat. I like flying in Sebastian because you just hang the door up. And that sea breeze comes in. <sighs> yes, you fly in the caravan. I do it for a caravan. Why do you jump out of a perfectly good airplane? It's the most fun I've ever had. It's the best experience anyone could ever imagine. And despite people calling you crazy, you gotta just go after what you love in this world. A lot of people will call you crazy too. Lot. But it's but worth that's it. just their fear talking. It's worth Straight it, up. and it's a great community, and it's awesome. And Zoe loves it too. This is Zoe. Hot air balloons. Yes. <laughs> Hot air balloons. <laughs>